Hello, I'm Calvin Butler, and I extend greetings to you on behalf of BGE and our 3,200 employees. Now, while BGE has always been a strong presence in Central Maryland, as part of Exelon, we have worked to build on our foundation and evolve our role. We are now a key driver for the regional economy. Our journey and our partnership, however, is just beginning. I'd like to take this occasion to update you on two exciting initiatives. First, in March, a new class of 11 businesses began BGE's Focus 25 program. I hope you are all familiar with this intensive program for minority, women, service disabled, and veteran owned businesses in our region. With Focus 25, we provide an in-depth overview of BGE's business processes, share our operational goals, and provide insight on how suppliers can be essential partners. So far, 18 companies have graduated from Focus 25, and BGE has spent more than $60 million with these particular companies. We expect the 11 new companies will become important business partners for us as well. Why is this important? Why does BGE actively seek partnerships with diverse businesses? For us, it goes beyond the right thing to do. We have very compelling evidence that these partnerships help us drive results and fulfill our business goals. Since we kicked off our supplier diversity efforts into high gear, BGE has simultaneously seen a marked rise in our customer satisfaction ratings and stellar financial and operational results. This is news worth spreading, which we are preparing to do. My second update is that BGE played a key role in the launch of the recent Be Local initiative, spearheaded by the Johns Hopkins University. Be Local is a pledge by 25 companies to build, hire, buy, and invest in the city of Baltimore. It's a move to address some of the underlying issues and disparities brought to light during the unrest in the city. The 25 companies, including BGE, have pledged to jointly invest an additional $69 million in Baltimore over the next three years. The pledge includes increasing the number of design and construction contracts with local minority-owned and women-owned companies. BGE has also committed to sharing the best practices of our Focus 25 program with the other local companies seeking to engage more minority vendors. We are very enthusiastic about moving this program forward. I want to thank Wayne Frazier for his continued friendship and partnership and allowing me this opportunity to update you on BGE's continued commitment to supplier diversity. Please stay tuned as BGE continues to engage with our partners throughout Central Maryland to help build and grow minority and women-owned businesses. Thank you.